Yes, and welcome to Two Minute Life Tick. We're actually looking today at repeating tasks. So these are tasks for a goal that have a recurrence. So they could be weekly, monthly, daily, um, or weekdays, for example. So let's go ahead and do one right now. What we're looking at is the task screen for a particular goal, which is to take the family on holiday to Tasmania for the summer. We can see we've already created a single task here, so we want to go in and add another task that's going to be a repeating one. As you can see, that changes the options available. So let's begin with one related to saving some money. So let's say uh, save um, $100 per week. So we've got some options here. The first one is when are we actually going to start this? So for simplicity we might say, look, you know what, it's uh, fresh new year, let's start that 1st of January 2018. And clearly we're going to want to do that weekly because we've already said that in the task itself. So here's where you have two options. You can actually run it for a number of occurrences. So we say, right, we might want to save $1,000 so let's just run it for 10 weeks. Or we could say, let's just run it until a certain date. So we want to give ourselves as much money to enjoy this trip as we can. So we're just going to run that through to the end of November. Of course, reminders are also available for recurring tasks. And therefore, they, the recurring nature of the task means that you're only presented with the options for that particular instance. So for example, if we chose on the day, that means every week we would get a reminder for this. We chose one day before, every week we get a reminder one day before that weekly task is due. Now, you also have the ability to add notes like every other task. So if we click save, what we can see now is this task looks a little bit different to the, the single task. It has a little recurring or repeating icon and we can see that we've done zero of 48 instances. So every time we click on that and complete an instance or we complete several or we can skip one if, we, if we're fallen behind and we don't want our due dates to get all mixed up, we can just go complete and that's going to show one completed and it's now shifted our due date for the next task. And again, we can go in and edit as well. So that's repeating tasks.